While working in the engine bay, locate the top of your motor mount. The left side engine mount is shown in this photo with the air filter housing removed. Remove the nut from the top of the motor mount, indicated by the green arrow. While still working in the engine bay, you will want to locate the right side motor mount. The right side engine mount is shown in this photo looking down past the exhaust manifold. Remove the nut from the motor mount indicated by the green arrow. Next, support the engine from below using a hydraulic jack. Place a block of wood between the corner of the engine pan and the jack pad, green arrow. While working from below the engine at the subframe, remove the lower engine mount nut indicated by the green arrow. Tip, if you have one bad engine mount and one good mount, remove the bad mount first. Next, loosen the engine mount nut on the opposite side of the engine mount you are replacing. Do not remove the nut, indicated by the green arrow. Doing this allows the engine to be raised enough to remove the engine mount on the opposite side of the engine. Jack the engine until the engine mount can be removed from the vehicle. You will see the upper engine mount stud move free of the upper bracket, green arrow. Remove the engine mount from the vehicle once it's free. Installation is the reverse of removal. Thanks for watching. Click here to view the original article along with hundreds of other DIY content for your car.